Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to another Shindo Life video. Today we'll be doing the showcase of the brand new Bloodline, which is the Pika Senko Bloodline. So yeah, if you're new to the channel guys, you should definitely subscribe. We're like so close hitting 9,000 subscribers. We're like 120 subscribers away from that goal. And yeah, if you can subscribe, it would mean a lot to me. Become a channel member, support me. All my socials are in the description below and let's get on with the video. Alright guys, so this bloodline was inspired by the character uh, Kizaru from One Piece. So if you have seen One Piece, you'll definitely know uh, some of the moves. You'll probably recognize some of them. But yeah, let me just turn on the volume as well. So we've got three moves, Time Cell, Star Kick, uh, Star Kick Rising, and Star Bomb Barrage. So we're going to go to first, which is Star Kick, which is this. Oh my lord, that did 30k. Oh my lord, dude. That was sick. Ain't what the hell? So, as you can see there, you shoot out this laser, right? And once you shoot out a laser, you teleport to, I guess, the enemies that are near to you and you just kick them. Uh, as you can see, I hit both of these logs and I pretty much did 15k for each. I did uh, 30k for this one and I did 15k for this one, which is really good. Maybe if we're doing it for a play, maybe we'll do even more. These are training logs, they don't move after all. But yeah, that was the first boot, which is really great in my opinion. Let's see the range of this if I do it from here. Ooh, yeah. Or oh, even breaks a game. Oh my lord, dude. Yeah, I wouldn't I wouldn't recommend you guys do this from like a far away place because you're gonna get stuck there. As, <laughs> oh my lord, okay, they have to fix that. That's the actual bug. Uh maybe maybe uh you'll be able to hit hit someone if they get closer to you, but yeah, don't do that in a longer range. <laughs> Worst mistake of my life. Alright, second one we've got is time style star kick rising, which is this. Wait, what the hell just happened? They didn't do no damage, but pretty much I'm guessing you teleport to the enemy and then you just go back and just I guess do that really huge explosion. I'll do it again because we we don't know how much damage that did. Uh there we go. Holy crap, 41,000 damage. That is sick. I ain't gonna lie. You could probably uh, act like you're like gonna hit them, but you're actually not. You're just in the air, but you, then you hit them. Uh, that could be a really good move, but yeah, I like this move. Now, the last move we got is Time Style Star Bomb Barrage, which is this. Sheesh. Alright, so pretty much it shoots out the, I guess, that star thing and it does 4,000, pretty much 5,000 each, which is good. Um, I mean, it's not really the best and it's the last move as well, so, I'll, I'll, like, the first two moves were absolutely great. The third one, I, I want to say, is really the greatest. I guess it's a move they added so they could just nerf uh, the bloodline a bit, which is fair enough. But yeah, let's go and use our mode really fast. Let's just equip it and there we go. If you look to the right, this is how much stats I gain. We gain like like 3,000 time. Oh, that's good. And as you can see, uh, we have the sword and we actually sparkle. I think just like the character does as well. You can actually train your what's it called Kenjutsu as well. Uh, that's what that's what I've been doing as well with the Kenjutsu. But yeah, you can train it with it as well. So yeah, this is a, this is how the M1. I'll turn off the trail so you can see how it looks. So uh, yeah, this is how the M1 looks and. This is the key spec. Hey, that key spec, 45,000 for the key spec, that reminded me so much for Dio, uh, Dual Senko. Like, Dual Senko, that reminded me of that uh, weapon, which is really great, honestly. And we did like 40,000, that's really good in my opinion. Look at that, 45, bro. 50k damage pretty much with the mode. Like, that's good, that's really good. Alright, so let's use our C spec. Oh my god, 61,000! Hello, bro, you, you cannot tell me this bloodline ain't no busted, bro. Holy crap, How? I think it was like a 15 to 20 second cooldown for the C-Spec. That is so good. I'm not gonna lie, bro. Pika, Pika no uh, Senko, that's what they called it, but I think they called it a Pika blood, uh, Senko. Yeah, they called it Pika Senko. That is really good. Let me try it from far away distance. Hopefully it doesn't break, but... Holy crap, dude, that is insane. Oh my god, dude. But yeah, guys, this is the Pika uh, Senko Bloodline. Uh, let me know down below what your thoughts on it. Honestly, I think this is absolutely amazing. Like, this... this <laughs> bro, this Bloodline is god tier. Oh my bro, that's, that's a... Um, X move as well. If you guys don't know what that is, that's the dash one. It's, is it the same as double? No. But uh, it's the one way just... Uh, press X and it gives like an extra jump. Okay, that's good. 
Uh, uh, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like down below. If you aren't subscribed, we're trying to hit 9,000 subscribers. At 10,000 subscribers, we'll be doing a Shindo Life uh, Game Pass giveaway. All my socials are in the description below, and I'll see you later. Peace out.